slow movements, okay? I don't know what kind of side effects the procedure might have had. No one's ever done this before. How do you feel? I have this burning feeling inside my skull. It's like it's on fire. That's not surprising. All the synapses in your brain have just been pulled apart, connected to someone else, and then pulled back together. I injected you with a large stim pack while I was pulling you out. That should ease things. Are you ready to talk about what happened in there? I saw Kellogg's life. The man who ruined my family. The man I killed. That's right. He was a human being just like the rest of us. And he had reasons for being what he was. However cruel. How does that make you feel? It's convinced me that I did the right thing. He was a rabid dog. And he needed to be put down. I suppose I can't fault you for that. We're getting off track. The important thing is that we discovered the Institute's greatest secret. Teleportation. The only question is, what do we do now? That scientist Kellogg was supposed to track down. Virgil, we need to find him. You're right. A rogue Institute scientist could answer all kinds of questions. Where did the memory say he was? The glowing sea? That doesn't make sense. No one goes there. Not even if they were desperate. That's why he's there. To make the Institute think twice about following him. That must be it. He's using the radiation in the glowing sea like a shield, or a cloak. A way to throw them off and be at an advantage. If Virgil found a way to survive there, you'll have to do the same. If you're going to follow him. How do I fight that much radiation, Doctor? There are chemical compounds. Radax, Radaway. You'd need as much as you could carry. Maybe more. A sealed environment suit would be great if you could find one. Or maybe one of those suits of power armor? That would be perfect. I'll find a way to get through the rads. Don't worry. Good luck. And be safe. By the way, I unplugged Mr. Valentine first. Removed the implant while you were waking up. He's waiting for you upstairs. Hey, Valentine. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my head. <laughs> that was right. I should have killed you when you were on ice. You want to try for round two? Let's go! What? What are you talking about? You sounded like Kellogg just then. Did I? Huh. Mari said there might be some mnemonic impressions left over. Anyway, I feel fine, so let's get going. Or I could head back to Diamond City, since you've got company already. We have to head into the Glowing Sea. Any advice? Hmm. I'm a synth, so radiation isn't much of an issue for me, but an old suit of power armor might just be the guardian angel you're looking for. That, or you could buy up all the Radex and rad away you can find from any chem dealer who's got it in stock. There's something wrong with you, Nick. I don't want you with me. I told you I'm fine. But I get it. Going through Kellogg's brain was a doozy for both of us. I'll be in Diamond City when you've had time to cool off. <laughs> 